We've all been staying at home during the pandemic, including Saints punter Thomas Morstead. And not only has he been keeping his leg in shape, but as Meg Ferris reports, he's also been using the time to help kids in the community. Follow Saints punter Thomas Morstead on Instagram and you see his wife and four children come okay. first. Helping other children is also important through his foundation, What You Give Will Grow. Today he donated his book, The Middle School Rules, to children in Oxner Hospital and spent virtual time with them. Why do you write this book? His most important lesson, he told them, was in high school, missing a PAT and state championship playoffs. He could have blamed the more narrow NFL goalposts in the Astrodome. Instead, he took responsibility and overheard his dad say he was proud. Ever since then, I've always tried to just take accountability for everything that goes on in my life, and um, I think that's one of the quickest ways to being happy. He's gotten creative with training during the pandemic, kicking over the power lines near his home. His car windshield took the brunt of one. I can't not train. Like, I need to be, you know, staying ready, and it's, you know, as I'm getting older, it's, it's more important now than ever. And when it comes to the coronavirus and the future? And there's a lot of really smart people and there's a lot of people that are very motivated to get this done. So that gives me a lot of hope that we're going to get there as quickly as possible. And during a time when people are not working, he joined former Saints player Jed Collins to post about financial literacy and budgeting. It was really cool hearing neighbors say, hey, keep posting. I'm sitting down with my 12 year old or my 15 year old every day. and We're going over it together. He says his main squeeze smoothies are a passion teaching health and balance to the people and city he loves. You know, New Orleans has definitely uh, brought a balance to my life uh, that I probably needed. Um, you know, New Orleans isn't, isn't so worried about tomorrow and people get the shirt off their back. He says it's unclear how the pandemic will change the NFL season. And when it comes to supporting teammates and any type of protest, he's growing in his understanding. I look forward to being part of uh, whatever our collective team decides to do, I'm sure it will be powerful, and I'm excited to be part of that. Meg Farris, Eyewitness News. And Morstead said there is a lot of leadership in the Saints locker room, and any conflict has only helped them grow.